Since I'm replacing all the fuel line, I'm just gonna go ahead and replace all the fuel line. Get these new little pieces here, some high pressure hose. Durability. I was in here changing the fuel line out guys I noticed that split in that hose between the water pump and the block so that's got to get dressed that's gonna be kind of a motherfucker I think without pulling that water pump I don't know give it a shot and see what happens all right so what I want to do here is I'll run this fuel line um, up here and Maybe around here over the carburetor. But I'm gonna mount. I got one of these Mr. Gasket uh, glass fuel filters. I'm gonna mount that in here somewhere. We'll see. hard oil line in here that's not doing anything but taking up some real estate. Guys, we got brand new fuel rail, a fuel line coming off the new setting unit. Running down the frame rail behind the shocks. Alongside here, off to the factory. Connection spots. Under the crank, or under uh, the The fuel line case. did run up next to the exhaust when I got this truck, which is just retarded. So that fuel line coming up right there right now. All right, so the fuel line comes up the side of the fender there. I got inline filter right there which is pre-fuel pump. New line going down to the fuel pump. New line coming off the fuel pump with a Mr. Gasket inline glass fuel filter. Into the fuel rail and it's got new pieces of uh, line at the carburetor. So. Time to put some gas in her. Listen to her run a little bit. Two gallons of ethanol free premium. Thank <laughs> you. 
There we go, starting to get some fuel in there now. Right, I'm gonna try this again. This um, filter here. Yeah, I shouldn't have listened to him, but I asked the guy at the parts store if I should put any sealant on the threads between the adapter and the filter. He said no, they're plastic to metal. It'll seal. Well, it didn't. So I took it back off. Um, put Teflon tape on the threads. I don't know if that's gonna work or not, but I'm waiting for this to dry right here because a little gas ran back out. But just got that filled up. Notice it was leaking. So. Try it all one more time. All right, we got fuel in the filter. Should start getting fuel into the bowls of the carburetor now. She wants to start, she just won't. Well guys, I got the carburetor out of the truck. I'm on hold with Jags right now. Um, guy's actually doing a really good job trying to find the parts kit for me for this. It's a 4310-10 Holly, which is a uh, 750 CFM, but I can't find the parts number for the kit to rebuild it, and neither can the guy in Jags, so he's, he's looking pretty hard for me. But it looks like I'm gonna have to rebuild the carburetor. Uh, it's just full of trash, man. I pulled the sides off and it's just full of trash, not spraying any, flute, any fuel. Accelerator pump seems like it's all froze up. So, one more project, guys. <laughs> 